Good morning. Today we're here at Kroger. We're going to go ahead and check out some of the sales prices for the week. Some of the things you guys have asked about and check the shelves. Let's get to it. As soon as we come into Kroger here, uh, it does look like it's going to be another digital week here. The best deals that I see as soon as I look at the ad are digital coupons. No buy five or more or any of that. Uh, four point... Four times fuel points on Friday purchases. That's a good way to save on gas. But uh, cheese, it's here, three twenty nine on a digital coupon. Does look like Pringles are on a digital coupon this week, dollar forty nine. Again, with all of these digital coupons, you can use up to five times. That's a good way to save. I just know a lot of people don't like doing the digital coupon thing. That's why I like to see different deals. But we'll see what we see today. I will say, at first glance, we are seeing a lot of digital coupons. Triscuits are now $3.99 regular price, $2.79 on the digital coupon, which is more than the last time on the digital coupon. They were $2.49, so we have to pay attention to that, too. Same goes for Ritz crackers. You can tell some people are buying them up here. Um, let's see, $2.79 on the digital coupon. These are $4.29 regular price, so an okay deal, but still up from the last digital coupon probably about a month ago. These were $2.49, so $0.30 cent price increase even on the sales. Now, I just noticed in the center aisle here they do have Powerade Zero, the 28-ounce bottles of them for a dollar. No extra purchase required. You do not have to buy 10 for 10. Just use your Kroger Plus card and get them for a buck. Okay, so we're going to check out some of the produce here today, maybe some when we go to Kroger Marketplace. Uh, definitely a lot of things we want to check out today, especially a lot of the digital coupons. But I wanted to point out the 10-pound bag of Idaho potatoes is still $6.99, not $7.99. does look like their yellow onions have come down in price. They are $2.69 for three pounds. Uh, they were $2.99, but we saw them get up to $3.49 at one time a couple months ago, so... Good to see that drop in price a little bit, and it says locked in low price, so we'll see how long that lasts. They do have the large white onions on sale. These are normally $1.29 a pound, $0.99 cents a pound, and they have the big yellow onions on sale, $0.99 cents a pound. But these are the bigger ones. Um, arguably, I think these look a lot better. They have their eight pound bag of navel oranges on sale for $6.99. That is down from $7.99. I gotta say, we're at the Kroger that we usually shop at here and the produce is looking pretty good. I gotta say, uh, everybody who works here at this Kroger and the produce does a great job. Uh, let's see, watermelon, $7.99. That's still too much for me. Regular price, $8.99. We've, so I saw them at Publix for $10.99, so. I don't know. Uh, they should be getting a little cheaper here, I would say, maybe in a month, maybe two months. $7.99 still a little, a little much. Okay, well, we noticed that apples went up here another dime. I had a feeling since they went up at Meyer, they would be coming up here also. They were $1.89, now $1.99 a pound. However, they do have some of these, like, smaller lunchbox apples here. Red Delicious, Gala, and Granny Smith. All four for three, and honestly, I like the smaller ones anyway. I'm glad to see Kroger doing this. Okay, so they have their red and black. They got black seedless grapes here. Uh, 99 cents a pound. You can use up to five times. 99 cents a pound on the digital coupon. However, green grapes, again, are not included. They are $2.49 a pound, which, I mean, that is down from $2.79 a pound a little bit over a month ago, but still... Uh, I just don't understand why these aren't, usually they all go on sale on a digital coupon, but for whatever reason, these ones aren't. So I had noticed the inconvenience sticker on the black grapes, but it looks like they're getting some in. It's the first time I've seen inconvenience stickers on blackberries and raspberries. Now they have them here, but I wonder if that's going to be an issue later. That's what we usually see. Look at this. Six ounce thing of uh, raspberries, $2.50. You do not have to buy two. But I recommend it if you like raspberries because they are $3.99 a pack now, which is absolutely ridiculous. They do have the uh, 12 ounces, $4.99. These are regularly $6.98. Blackberries on sale also two for five. Don't have to buy two, but $2.79 regular price for one. Oh, these hothouse tomatoes, I got to say, they look fantastic, but they do keep going up in price. We saw where they went up at Meyer. 
289 here also at Kroger. This is up for, you know, these were two, uh, 229 just a couple months ago. We saw them go up to 269 a pound initially and now 289 a pound. But I will say they look great. Another inconvenience sticker on the tomatoes on the vine. And you know what? We saw a lot less at Meyer than we usually see too. So another item, produce, we have to keep an eye on. Another inconvenience sticker on bell peppers, on the yellow bell peppers. This is getting kind of crazy. Um, I will say, okay, so Kroger is starting. You really got to pay attention now, guys, because they're starting this stuff. Final cost when you buy five. Okay, so in a way, it's kind of like the five or more, but qu uh, quantities less than five priced up to $1.50 each. I saw a few other items back here we're going to check here in just a minute, but if you want the bell peppers for 99 cents, you have to get five of them. Okay, so here we have some cremet pasta here for 99 cents. Final cost when you buy five, but just talked to a buddy of mine, and he was telling me that this is a mix and match deal. Five or more participating items and pay just 99 cents. So everything on this new deal that they have going on at Kroger, it's brand new, uh, is going to be 99 cents. So it's not to buy five or more, but you, I believe it is multiples of five, though. I think you do have to, let's see, offer valid 412 through 425 discount applied at checkout. Items must be purchased in the same transaction with your card. Some items may not be available in all stores. Mix and match five or more. Okay, so you can go over five. It doesn't, maybe not multiples of five. So that's good, I guess. Uh, I don't know. I mean, we'll see what we see here. I do see some good items on this deal, though. Got the Kraft barbecue sauce. It's regularly $1.79. See if it went up. Nope, regular price, $1.79. Uh, that's a good deal. 99 cents. And I like that you don't have to buy five of each item. That would be ridiculous. It does look like we have some Campbell's over there on the same deal. And, uh, this is a digital coupon. So, this isn't part of that. Okay, so they have Starbucks on a digital coupon this week. Uh, the ground and the Keurig pods for $7.99. Keurig pods are still $9.99. The ground is now... 10.99 and i did confirm that that is five or more items once you get to that fifth item or more all of those items will be 99 cents on the different 99 cent items it's kind of a weird deal and it doesn't look like there's too many products that are that this week uh look at this uh kroger brand private selection keurig pods went up these were 5.99 forever now 6.49 i guess 4.59 on the digital coupon i was a little thrown off guard with that new deal i wanted to get over here to the coffee to kind of just get away from it all for a second so we could check out some of the coffee deals uh yeah that's it's cool get stuff for 99 cents but it was very confusing duncan keurig pods are on sale this week for 6.99 look at the regular price went from 8.99 to 9.99 in a week up one dollar in one week 6.99 on the digital coupon though and we've got a couple of the bigger green mountain coffees on the digital coupon uh 32 cups down from 22 49 to 19.99 they do have a couple digital coupons on pete's coffee but it's the bigger 18 ounce packs the ground um they do have some of the whole bean up here also and that is on the digital coupon for 12.99 uh, this is definitely the best deal. They do not have the smaller shrink flated 10.5 ounce uh, things of it here. These are $12.49 regular price. So if you're going to get one of these, you might as well get a big one. These are regularly $16.99 now. Digital coupon on Seattle's best this week. Um, yes, they are $7.29 now. Somebody was asking me if that was the correct price. Yes, it is. Regular price on sale for $4.99. Um, let's see. We've got... The Javelia here on sale, $5.99. That's down $2 on the digital coupon. That's a pretty good deal. And they do have the Duncan Ground on sale on the digital coupon this week. It's digital week, guys. Digital week here at Kroger. Uh, $6.99 on the digital coupon for that. And it looks like we have a little bit of a break on Folgers Coffee. Uh, $10.49 down from $11.49. So just a regular sale. No extra purchase required. 
They have a digital coupon on Maxwell House, but I mean, yeah, it is a dollar fifty off, but it is the most expensive digital coupon we've ever seen on Maxwell House. Usually, it's right around six ninety nine to seven ninety nine on the digital coupon, eight forty nine. So yeah, you're still saving a dollar fifty, but not as good as we've seen in the past. For those who are wondering, they still have the Bigelow tees here at Kroger two for six dollars. You do not have to buy two with this deal. Really got to pay attention to that now, though. Uh, four nineteen regular price is absolutely insane. Three dollars and twelve cents is the regular price at Walmart. So when this sale ends, Walmart will be the cheapest place. Uh, for this ends April twenty fifth, twenty twenty three. Uh, two for six. All you guys that have been asking about Bigelow Tees, it's the best best deal we've seen so far. They also have the different celestial herbal teas and different teas here uh, on a digital coupon, $2.49. Good deal on the Dole Fruit Cups this week, $1.99 on the digital coupon. These have gone up to $3.19, up $0.20 cents in less than a couple weeks. $1.99 on the digital coupon, though, you can use up to five times. So I wanted to check the pasta aisle here to see if the same deal applied to all cremet spaghetti. It does. Uh, buy five or more, $0.99 cents each. Final cost, five or more. You do not have to buy five of the same product. We did confirm it is mix or match. Um, yeah, that's a pretty good deal. So when I first originally walked into the store i was a little confused i walked right past this because i was like oh that's expired this is not the buy five or more save a dollar each deal this is a whole separate deal um, i almost wish they used like a different color on here like purple or something to make it look different uh, but this does apply to the green giant vegetables also 99 cents a piece when you get to that buy five or more mix and match so you don't have to buy five things of green giant it makes a match between the spaghetti and everything else that is on this participating deal. Does look like the Crisco sale is over. They are back up to $6.49. Uh, the Crisco canola oil did lower from $7.49 to $6.99. So still ridiculously overpriced. But they do have the Kroger canola oil for $3.99 and the vegetable oil still for $3.69. I was walking past here, I noticed that the Kroger salt, uh, their salt went up a dime. It's It was 59 cents, now 69 cents. The Morton salt went up a dime. It was $1.39, now $1.49. Just caught that in my peripheral vision there. It does look like a lot of their spices are still pretty low when it comes to Kroger spices. All these ones that have just gotten to ridiculous prices... I'm surprised they took the buy two, get one free deal down because these are insanely overpriced. Pretty much all flour prices are the same of what we went over last week. Um, you know, they got the bread flour back in. This one, somebody was asking about this one. They got the whole wheat here. Both of these are $6.99. Kroger ones are still the same price for now. Um, but yeah, more importantly, they actually have bunch in here the last time i came here i didn't do a video but they were very low on flour all the flour does look like they've got their bigger bags of sugar back in um these 10 pound bags were 719 but they have taken the sticker down so i don't know if they changed 1359 still for the 25 pound bag of sugar still 999 for the 10 pound bag of domino surprised to see that uh, the four pound bag is back up to 449. That sticker needs to be taken down. That was part of the buy five or more last week, which is expired. 379 now for the pure cane Kroger sugar. A little, little more than a month ago, that was 349. But the four pound bag of the cheapest Kroger sugar, two dollars and nineteen cents. So it looks like pretty much all of the Nature Valley bars are on the digital coupon this week. Been seeing these on sale all the time. Why do you think that is? Because nobody's going to pay $4.49 for a thing of oat and honey bars that have shrinkflated in size. They need to just change the regular prices on these, and these have even gone up. $4.49. These were $4.29 just a few weeks ago. $4.49 regular price. $1.99 now. Guys, if you eat these, stock up on them. I have a bunch. I bought them when they were $1.99 the last time. I like them, but I will never pay, I don't know, even $3 is too much. And this is what a lot of people were talking about on the channel. Unless it's on a digital coupon or something, forget cereal. 
I mean, guys, cereal prices, we even saw at Walmart. They're really starting to go up at Walmart, too. And Walmart doesn't have, like, sales. They'll have rollback offers, but that's far and few between on specific products. Look at this. Family size box, $5.49. But, you know, there are some decent deals on the digital coupons. But, again, even higher on the digital coupons, higher on the sale than it's ever been. These were $1.99 the last time they were on a digital coupon. $2.49 now. $2.49. And some of these, some of them are $1.99. But, you know, good to see Honey Bunches of Oats. That one's rarely ever on sale. And that's half off. $1.99. That's $4 now for a regular small box of cereal. My mom gets these protein uh, in different fiber or protein, maple and brown sugar. She said these went up a dollar. She said these were five ninety nine. dollars I never pay too much attention to these ones. But uh, yeah, went up a dollar, five ninety nine to six ninety nine. She was going over her receipt with me and how much more she spent uh, this time around compared to what it was last year. And guys, it's crazy. She spent almost double and didn't really get too much. And, you know, let us know down below if you have similar stories to these kind of situations. I'm sure we all do. Also, if we're providing good information for you and you are liking our channel here, don't forget to subscribe down below. Give us a thumbs up. It really helps spread the word. You can also share our videos to your social media. Uh, it really helps us out a lot. We really appreciate it. Um, no price increase on the instant oatmeals, the regular here, $3.69 um, and $6.99 for the 18 pack. So same price on these, but yes, the protein ones and the high fiber and the gluten free all went up a dollar. Another price increase my mom was talking about and she was pretty upset and I would be too. Her favorite drink here, the Sutley Sweet Peach Tea, uh, lower sugar here, the Pure Leaf. So these are on a digital coupon, right? They went up. They went up from $7.49 to $8.49. So this is another item that went up a dollar within just a couple weeks. But the digital coupon is only good on these, and it's not good on the one she likes. So, you know, I mean, <laughs> I think that's there. This one, too. So I guess the lower sugar. So if you want to drink healthier stuff, you're not going to get the discount, I guess. Look how much these Arizona teas have gone up. It's been a while since I've been down this aisle, actually. I mean, I don't usually get tea from Kroger. Um, but Arizona tea, $3.79 regular price. This was $2.99 last year. And the sale only brings it down to $3.50. Now, I remember I, I saw it on sale a while back, and it was a sale for $2.99. I believe it was on a digital coupon. I think all these were. The $3.79 regular price for the, you know, I mean, I like Arizona sweet tea. But... $3.50, even a sale, it's not that great. Cycling back around, they even raised these single sweet teas up a dime. I remember they were $2.49 a piece. $2.49 a piece, guys, for one. I mean, come on, you know, that's ridiculous. Like, at $2.49, it was expensive. Now you just raise it. It's like a slap in the face. Like, ah, oh, we're just going to add an extra dime. Did want to do a quick glance over butter. No sales at all. None. Um... Yeah, I don't know. We saw a couple rollback offers on Land O'Lakes uh, at Walmart for $5, but it's about the best we've seen. Uh, one pound of butter at Walmart is $4, uh, $4.49 here at Kroger for the salted and unsalted. Good deal on the Pillsbury Grands, $2.50 this week. Uh, that's a pretty good deal. Down from $3.29, well, you know, an okay deal. Uh, and they got the crescents included in that. So you can, I guess you can mix and match on these. Oh, that makes it worth it. So the two packs of Philadelphia cream cheese are back up to $6.49. However, that is still a better, a little bit of a better deal. Um, the brick is on sale for $3.49, down one dime of the crazy $3.59 price hike. I know we have a lot of Sargento fans on the channel here. They do have a sale going on, two for six. You do not have to buy two, but I recommend it because they are $3.99 a pack. Okay, so somebody had recommended that I check out toothpaste prices. Um, I know they've been going up. Uh, wow, here's one for 99 cents. I didn't think I'd be able to find one for a dollar, but there is one on sale for a dollar. Everything else, though, has gotten extreme uh, some sales though on the Colgate, uh, $1.99 for the big tube on the digital coupon, $2.99 for those. And yes, I know a lot of these other ones though have gotten 
insanely expensive. Look at Sensodyne, six ninety nine. I mean, come on. I thought that was ridiculous when it was five dollars. Uh, Crest, same thing. Crest now five dollars. Look at that, five forty nine here for Crest. Come on now. I don't care if it says advanced. One thing I do notice with Crest here, though, is they have a spend forty save ten dollars deal. Uh, mix and match select PNG items with cards. So maybe uh, Tide and stuff like that is, is on sale on this participating deal. We won't be able to go over all that today, but I did want to point this out. So yes, it is digital week again here at Kroger. They do have the 99 cent thing where if you buy five or more, those items on that participating deal will become 99 cents a piece. Uh, it's all confusing. I mean, I, you know, I like seeing stuff like that, but I did go around in the store. Pretty much everything that we saw in the video today uh, is all that I saw of the things that are 99 cents. So if you happen to know any more, let us know down in the comments. But for the most part, yes, it is digital week and we continue to see more price increases. Um, I know we had gotten a couple comments on toothpaste. I wanted to check that out. Yeah, I mean, it's it's all going up, guys. I mean, it's getting ridiculous in the stores. I feel like it's only going to keep getting worse. I hate to say that, but this is why I always say when we find the sales of the things we want to buy up a few of them, you know, if you have the extra money, go ahead and get a few extra so that you have it, you know, because next time you go to the store, chances are pretty good that the price is going to be going up on it. But guys, thank you so much for watching today. Oh, and I will be going to Kroger Marketplace here in a couple days. Uh, to check out the meat and a lot of the things we missed. I just ran out of time. Guys, thank you so much for watching. With all that being said, I am out. And always remember, the adventure is out.